Hello, lovely people. Welcome to the Geek of it. I am Penge, and it is New Year's Eve 2017. So, to see out the year, to see out the old year, we are going to play a game called Death Coming. Because death is indeed coming for 2017. It doesn't have long left. It's going to fade away, and we shall never see its like again. But don't worry, because 2018 is coming. I'm not going to kill that with my death powers. I'll leave 2018. So yes, I thought Death Coming would be an appropriate game. It's been on the radar for a little while and I've given it a go and it actually is really good fun. However, there is something a little bit worrying in that in a game called Death Coming, where you adopt the role of a Reaper, which is kind of like Death, although Death is kind of your boss, I suppose, um, in a game about going around and essentially killing people, a little bit Final Destination style -y, Santa is just here. I'm not going to kill Santa. I'm not going to kill Santa Claus, Father Christmas, whatever you want to call him, Old Saint Nick, or any of his reindeer, because that would make me one of the worst people in the history of the world. I'm not going to do that. If there's a level where I'm required to kill him, I'm not going to do that. And so I have played a little bit of this game just to get used to it. So let's dive straight in and I shall go into what the game's about and stuff as we play. Okay, so Act 1, life is like a game, you are just an NPC. Okay, that's a bit bleak. And yes, here is a person who has presumably fallen off this balcony and they're a bit dead. That's kind of what the game's about. So here we go, let's go into it and uh, I will explain as we play. So there we go. Here's the place we're in. Look, uh, some curious laser beam stuff going on. Oh yes, and there is a UFO. So there we go, UFO, spaceship pops out, an alien will come out. Okay, so the backstory is... I died. I got killed in a car crash along with the invasion. That's right, Mr. Alien. So I got killed in a car crash. And then this fella appeared. Him here. Death. Death appeared and said, hey, you can always get to be alive again if you like, but you've got to work for me. Here's a scythe. Here's presumably a kind of cloak. I assume I get a cloak with a hood and I can look all sinister. So uh, here's your stuff. You've got to help me kill some people. And if you help me kill some people, you can go back to being alive. So, uh, yeah, I accepted it because I didn't have much choice and said yes, and here I am. So I am now a Reaper. So we're in the town. Let's go to town. This is the first level. Let's go to town. Your job is to hasten the demise of those who've overstayed their welcome on Earth. <laughs> Okie doke. You use the Reaper's eye to find your targets. Try not to make a mess. <laughs> Imagine I might be making a mess if I'm killing people, death. And um, there we go. So this is this is the map. This is the world. And we have got to kill some people in it. And there are a variety of different ways to kill people. It's a very, very brutal game, isn't it? So, we can interact with some objects. But look, look at the little lovely people. They're all having a little swim. And these people are having a barbecue. Uh, I don't know what that is. Some sort of street food thing going on. But look, look, immediate, obvious danger. Look, electric. And if we click on things, I won't do it now. We can click on things and it highlights them. So it'll go, yes, streetlight circuit box, shot choir. If you touch it, you die. And now if we do this again, we have electrocuted that poor girl and killed her with electrics. Now this person will then panic and go, ah, and run around. They'll run around for a bit. But I think eventually they go back to where they were. So there's a big dance class over here. And it's lovely. There's so many little things going on. So many lovely little bits of animation. And, you know, there's a, a drunk man just here drinking himself away. There's a police person. There's a little vending machine. There's a giant octopus on the side of a building for some reason. I don't really know why. Bucket thing, bins, manhole covers. They're important. So it, it's lovely and detailed. It is a little bit... Also, there's not enough people. But in terms of the detail in the world, it reminds me a little bit of, like, Where's Wally or Where's Waldo? If you're in America, because he has a different name in the USA to the UK. So our plan, our job now is to basically go through here and get at least 32 people to get to B for bronze trophy. I've only just noticed that that silver trophy says A and, and the gold trophy says S. So B for bronze, A for aluminium and S for sugar i don't know i don't know what the s is <laughs> i don't know what the the but b is for bronze so we have to get at least 32 people dead we have to kill 32 people however there are three golden targets that we want that death wants us to kill we have to kill these three and then anyone else so here we go we've got to kill him you're bound by fate to these mark targets if you wish to live again you'll need to murder them all it's not very nice because the people all look quite lovely and innocent but we don't know they might have terrible terrible backstories these might be foul people so we're probably doing the world a favor that's what i'm going to tell myself 
Okay, so, though remember they're just a drop in the bucket, we have quotas to meet. Okay, so we need to get rid of this guy. There's a girl just there, sat on a chair, and there is a person looking through some windows. He's trying to look for a girl through a window. That's a little bit suspicious, isn't it? Okay, well, let's try and get him. So presumably, if I open a window while he's looking through it, is he going to fall out? Okay, so I can click the window. Death trap spotted. No. Okay, nothing happens. Ah, that one's shining on and off. Okay, you. Oh, the girl's there. The girl. No, okay. Okay, right, fine. So he didn't fall down on that one. Didn't fall down on that one. Let's try this one. Was there an alien behind this one? Is this the alien window? Can we open the window? Yes. Ah, there you go. So he wasn't expecting to see an alien looking through the window. And he fell down and died so fast. Okay, and that's the kind of game this is. You have to think a little bit obscurely. And then for whatever reason, the alien has done his job. I don't really understand what that is. I've got extraterrestrial kind of influence going on. The alien has done his job and then he goes away, <laughs> which is kind of cool. Now in the corner here is a hint button. So you can press the hints button and it shows you all the things that you can interact with. It shows you silhouettes of the things that you've not clicked on. So if we do that, we found the lampposty thing and we found a window. Obviously there's a thing here, there's a big truck thing, there's some little boxes and signs, there's a parasol. There's all these different bits and bobs. Now this here is fairly obvious. There is a man doing the... Oh, and they love each other. Now if I do that really quick... I can get three people. So I clicked on the... Um, it was only I did that really quick because the security guy was coming by. So um, the guy was washing the windows. I clicked on his plank thingy and it fell down and squished all those people. <laughs> Bear in mind that I am death. I'm supposed to be a horrid person. Right, these traffic lights, I believe, do something. So can we do something with the traffic lights and make them go all wrong? Now is that car going to... That car stopped. Okay, I thought the traffic lights were going to do something. Oh, no, never mind. Maybe I messed that up. Okay, there's still plenty of other things to do. Okay, here. Here is an obvious thing. An aircon unit above a drunk man. Let's knock that onto his drunk head. There we go. He's dealt with. And just here, I believe if I do that right, oh, that whacks this person. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's a fire to all those people. <laughs> They've all become charcoal. Okay, right. That's, <laughs> that's them dealt with then. Now, just here, there's a speaker, which I can't click on. Oh, there's a bee's nest. Right, if I drop the bee's nest down, it kills an awful lot of people in one go. They're very angry bees, aren't they? Those things. Good grief. Oh, one person survived. <laughs> one poor person survived. I'm very sorry. But look, we've got 18 out of the 32 we require. Right, let's get him. Let's see if we can do this guy. So I think if you click on him, it does say so. Peter likes it cool. Okay, well, he's under an umbrella. Can we make the umbrella fall on him? Death trap spotted. All right, so I'm going to take a dip. Aha, aha, aha. Right, okay, this wire. When he's in the pool, when he's in the pool, do this electric wire. And then I imagine it will electrocute all the people in the pool just like that. I never have to go tanning again. <laughs> That's probably the least of your worries, but okie doke, fine. There we go, so we've got a few more people. And everyone else that was in the pool is now also dead. Oh, dear. Uh, oh, bees on you. Can, we, can the bees come and get you now? No. Oh, that's a shame. Oh, this person might survive. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. We don't need to kill everybody. I think we just need to get to 32. Uh, okay. You just here. Okay, what can you do? There is a thing there. Right, can we drop that on that man's head? That scares her. Oh, oh, his lawnmower went and killed some people. Right, so she is now going to do that. Okay, that. Can I electrocute her with that? You'll die within seven days. <laughs> I'm giving her a, a spooky phone call. <laughs> oh, dear. Is she going to die within seven days? Uh, I don't know. Maybe she's going to sit on this thing and it'll flip up and kind of crush her or something. No. Okay. Okay, no, that didn't work as I expected. I thought she was going to then... Something was going to happen to her. Okay, fine. Right, okay. Well, let's do... Oh, what's that? The phone? Yeah. Ring ring the phone. Yes, there we go. There we go. Ring the phone. Quick, 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 and... It's just nothingness. Ah, 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 okay, no, but I can do this. She's going to go past that tile. She's going to go past there, and I can drop an aircon unit on her head. So... Boom! <laughs> there we go. I'm very sorry, but you're probably a terrible person as well. 
I've lost sight of what's important. You've lost sight of everything. You just had an aircon unit dropped on your face. Okay, good. Right, 26 people sorted. What else can we do? Okay, there's an obvious thing here which looks like that's got scuff marks. Is someone going to sit on this bench? Yes. Okay, right. Well, let's roll that towards him. That's killed him on the bench. Okay, that's good. That's at least something. Um, the dog? Can we knock the dog's house down? Does that make the dog angry? It does. Oh! Okay, the dog brutally mauled someone to death. That's, that's an unpleasant way to go. Okay, we're on 28. What else can we interact with? Oh, those that thing. Yes. Okay, yes. Vending machine falls over. That's good. Let's see if we can mess around with those again. Just see if we can cause some trouble with those. No, unfortunately not. Right, there's a manhole cover here. Is anyone coming this way? Is anyone coming this way? No. Okay, can we knock the trees down? No, can't knock the trees down. Okay, these guys here all look quite alive. That's a shame. I don't know what I can... Can I click on that thing and make that explode? No. Okay, I can't click that. Someone's got to walk past this manhole cover. Someone's got to walk past this. I can plunge them down there. Come on, somebody. Yes, you. Man in hat. You look like a good candidate. Ah, oh, damn you, man in hat. Okay, she's gone over there. Can I do something with that bench? The light? No. Okay, fine. We'll leave those for now. So there's other stuff going on. Okay, this looks obvious. Yes. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Two people. Yep, squish you both. <laughs> there you go. Terrible accidents happened. The top's fallen off the ice cream van. The ice cream seller doesn't care. But yeah, whatever. I got the money off him first. That's fine. Okay. There's a puddle. Can we do something with a puddle? No. Okay. More cars doing stuff. Oh, 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 oh. Manhole cover. Yay. Goodbye. Unhold man uncovered manholes are an awful way to go. Okay. So they're going to plummet down. And I now have... 32 kills. I believe death will come in and tell me something. Mission complete. Working overtime will award more experience, but of course, you can go to the next act anytime. Okay, so we've got seven things left that can injure people. So we've discovered 15 of the 22 things that are going to injure people. Uh, okay, I'll wait for you at the side. Come to me when you want to leave. Okay, gotcha, death. Gotcha, boss. Um, uh, anything up here? Anything on the top? Aircon? That thing? That picture looks a bit wibbly wobbly, doesn't it? Is someone going to walk underneath? Yes. Okay, good. This thing could fall on his head. Is he going to walk up the road? Mm, no, he's not going to fall. He's not doing it. He's not doing it. No one's coming this way. Okay, there's a building site stuff. No. Hello. <laughs> it just peeps in from the side. Hello. I like the fact that he's wearing a tie. That's good. <laughs> Thanks, Death. Thanks for putting a tie on. Um, What have we got left then? Uh, that looks like a sign of some sort. I don't know what that is. Or that. Or that. I don't know what that is. That is a palm tree. Ooh, coconuts. Coconuts. Oh, this is going to be horrible, isn't it? Bosh. <laughs> oh, and can, can I get the next person? Oh, no, they've gone into their house. They've gone into their house. You, you silly person. Come back this way. There's something lovely awaiting you. Okay, so that's that. Yeah, I don't know what these other bits are. What are they? Some signs. Brick, possibly. I don't know what those... Th What's that big thing there? Is that that? Is that the... Oh, does a satellite dish fall off? That's a mighty conspicuous satellite. Okay, let's make it fall off. Oh, no, it's going to shoot a, a laser beam. Uh, is, is, is that helpful? Do we want them to shoot a laser beam? I have no idea if that's good or bad. Can people walk through the laser beam and get vaporised? I honestly don't know. Doesn't seem to make any difference that way, or that way, or that way, or that. It just does something to just hear. That camera? No. Trash can? No. Okay, right. I'm running out of things to click on. Death keeps poking his head in saying, Hello, what are you doing? I don't know what those things are. That looks like a sign of some sort. Ah, signs. Is there a sign up here that could fall down? No, 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 no. None of those. Uh, a sign above another building. Ah, there. Ah, I can get you. Yes. <laughs> I got you. The famous wobbling sign. I got you. You. None of the dance troops survived. Oh, manhole cover. Oh, no. 
She wasn't walking toward it. She was walking round the manhole cover. Coconut. Yes. Coconut on your head. So this is all unnecessary. We don't need to be doing this. And I don't think I'm going to be able to get another 12 people. I've only got three things left to interact with. I don't really know what they are. Uh, I don't know what they are. So we might just go to the next. But are they these things? Are they those things? Yes, I think that it's these. I think it's these bits. But there's no one coming by here. So it doesn't really matter. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That sort of thing. If she comes down here, I'm going to be very cross. I am very cross. I'm very annoyed with you. <sighs> I just, just discovered what it was. And they've gone and done something else. Uh, okay, that's fine. Death, where are you? Come back. Hello, buddy. Let's go to the next stage. So here we go. Now, I did a little bit of this before. I did about a minute of this level. So that most of that was new to me. This next stage is going to be entirely new to me. So let's see what this brings. Okay, so these three things that must be the three key souls that I grabbed. They did fly down here. There is a little button here. I don't know what that does. Ah, okay. Okay, right. So these are three people we grabbed and they're in some sort of limbo, are they? <laughs> There's some sort of terrible limbo. So yeah, that was you in the pool. It was you uh, sunbathing and you were a perv. You were perving through a window because you're weird. Okay, well, let's go back to the map. So we've passed that. 35 out of 58. That's okay. That's acceptable. So the next level is here. Are we going to go to a school or something? It looks school-like. So that was a town. Maybe this is a school. So act two, love and peace. Okay. It looks very factory-like. Not all accidents are straightforward. Sometimes you've got to get creative. Like this guy, for example. Uh, okay. Oh, I need to turn this wheel. Ah, there is something that says hot. So I need to turn the wheel to make hot stuff come out of there and kill him. Do I? Okay. Bright shiny valve must turn. Humans are surprisingly diligent at times. This trap is under constant guard. You have to take him out first. Okie dokie. Right, I've got to take out the guard uh, by doing this here. Right, ring him on the phone and then drop a box on his head. Okay, I get that. Bosh. Okay, so squish a box on his head. Then, yep, well done. Now turn the valve. Gotcha, death man. Gotcha, I'm with you. And then blast him with <laughs> boiling hot steam or... I don't know what it was, acid or something, I've no idea. You are unsettlingly good at this. Keep your hands where I can see them. How come you aren't speaking in caps? You're deaf. You should be speaking in capital letters. Everybody knows this is the case. Okie doke. So what level is this then? Uh, okay, that was easy. Oh, it was a school. It was like a teaching level for me. He was teaching me how to play. Ah, okay. Right, we are in some sort of rocket silo place. In the desert, by the look of it. Okay, fine. Love and peace. You can't touch it under my eyes. Okay, I won't do then. Okay, so what do we have? It's a factory. There are conveyor belts. Sneaky spy. There's a spy. Sneaky spy. There's sneaky things. And here comes... Oh, that's not, is it? <laughs> What's that Kim Jong-un? Oh, right. Okay. So, it is... <laughs> It's supposed to be Kim Jong-un. Look at his hair. Sabotage. There must be a spy. Find him. Uh, everything sucks, but do carry on, my dear. What the? What was that? What earth was that? Okay, and there's a great big screen with staff on it. Okay, welcome to the boom boom room. At this rate, they'll never finish that missile. Methinks they need a gentle nudge. Okie doke. Also, that glory... <laughs> it is him. That glorious leader is a creep. He displeases me. Kill all his workers. For I am a vengeful god. Okay, right. Uh, <laughs> so we're in we're in North Korea, presumably, and we have to kill all these people. I think the locker room is a good place to start. So we're in North Korea, and we've got to kill Kim Jong-un's missile workforce. <laughs> okay, right you are. Please do not cause any diplomatic incidents through this. So here is Kim Jong-un's factory with a weird sign on the front. Is that a thing I can click on? Oh, there's a lot of people coming in from the... Ah, right. Okay, are you going to all come in here? Can I squish you with one of those? Oh, no, I missed. I entirely failed. Oh, botherations. Oh, you can get squashed, though. Right, there we go. That's two people squashed, and you're squashed as well. Triple kill. And you are squashed as well. So I've squashed quite a lot of people. There we go. We're up to, what, four? If that soul comes up here. Four, 39, we need good grief. Okay, who are the three people we need to get? A lady have Oh my goodness, cover your eyes, everybody. A lady having a shower. The glorious leader never leaves his office unless... 
Oh, I didn't see that unless something. I didn't see what it said. Okay, we'll come back to that. A dude here in a little truck. Okay. And the spy. Ah, okay. Well, I think I can take care of the spy. Because the spy, there's a radio thing here like we saw before. So if I do that... He goes to answer that, and then presumably that drops on his head. Okay, there we go. So one of the spies, is, uh, one of the spies, one of the main people is dead. The spy. My work is never finished. It is now, because you've been killed. You've been crushed to death by a rusty metal North Korean pipe. Okay, that guy's just going bonkers over there. Okay, right. There's a rocket. There's a, some sort of furnace. Nuclear material. That's always fun. Uh, okay, I can't click on that. Well, I can click the door. It only locks from the outside. Okay, quick, lock the door. Lock the door. <laughs> I'm just, <laughs> just irradiated two people to death. I'm very sorry. Sorry, folks. Oh, my goodness. Missiles. Tanks. Uh, okay. Right, there's missiles and tanks. Ah, ah, right, okay. Let's put the fire hydrant on. And that might electrocute you as you go by. So that's got you. Ah, ah, ah. Right, okay. These boxes are all going to fall off. I want them both to be stood here at the same time. That'd be good if I could kill both these dudes up here by dropping boxes on them now. Yes. Take that, North Korean innocent poor people. Sorry, everybody. Those ones, do they fall down? Mm, doesn't look it. Okay, I think I've done everything on that upper level. I think that's everything. Can I click that? Can I click that lever? Yes. I just squished somebody just there. I just flattened them with a lift. <laughs> oh, a valve. Uh, okay, those. Oh, oh, they do something. They probably explode. They probably explode. Is someone going to go to have a look at them? Go on, go and investigate the explodey things. And explosion oh not an explosion just being crushed okay that's fine that thing looks a bit rickety a, a metal bridge that's corroded so let's do that for you yes okay 13 we're looking good we're a third of the way there um what's going was that her yes that's her what what kind of room oh my goodness okay that's that's the glorious leader's Naughty time room. Okay, fine. Right, well, we won't dwell too much on what's in there. The lady goes in the shower. And what happens after that? He's thinking of the lady. The glorious leader doesn't leave unless something happens to his statue, they just said. So where is his statue? This? Is that his statue? The darn fan stuck. Oh, there's a button. There's a button. And if I turn it off, does he come down? Yes, <laughs> It gets minced through a fan. Okay, right. I can cope with that. That's good. Um, do I? Can I crush someone with a box? Ah, right. I could crush you with a box if you stand there and, and close enough. Right. Let's wait for. Let's wait for you. So it's you. You should then go back on your route to this box. So that'll kill you. Right. Killed. Daily fake news. Angel sightings reported. Okay, am I an angel? I wouldn't say I'm an angel. I say the police say, "Oh no, the 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 god police have come in. I've got angels." <laughs> That's brilliant. Oh, it's the angels who invited them. Be on guard. They're ready to bring the pain. You'll have to retreat if you're spotted three times. So watch yourself. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. What do they just? Do they just float about? Oh, yes, they do. They just sort of float around, causing trouble and being annoying. Uh, okay, what can we do here, then? Oh, right, that's the thing we can click on. Ah, that squished him. How can we kill you? Oh, box. Oh, no, I missed him. I thought it was going to get him. Right, hang on. Another box must come out of here at some point. Come on, come on, come on, come on, box. Come on. No, no, he's moved out the way. He's, he's, he's wily, is this one. He's a wily, cunning person. Oh, a little angel person coming by. Should be wary. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Killed him and the angel did not see. Okay. Cool, man. That's good. That's good. Uh, you. How am I going to kill you? Or are you another box person that's going to get squished by a box over here? What are they? What are they? Oh, that did the job then. <laughs> that was fine. Uh, those. These. That just makes a barrel in. Ah, do I drop this on his head as he goes by? 
Goodbye. Yes, I've squished you to death with a box in your little truck. Okay, beats working in this factory. It probably does, to be fair. Uh, okay, so he's taken care of. Now it's just a case of her. Oh, there's his statue. There's his slightly terrifying statue. I like that he's got a kind of um, uh, mask on. What's that from? A V for Vendetta star mask. <laughs> That's funny. Um, okay, can we kill you? You look really obvious as a target, but okay. That seemed fairly simple. Calm down, I'm just... Where's he going with that? Where are you going with this? You're... What? You're taking a bomb into the... Into the... Re... Into the break room? Okay, right. Do we... Can we just click on the bomb? Monster ah! Tail. Yeah, that works then. The, the, the bomb explodes, as bombs are, are, are prone to do. That's fine. I can't click on the mirror. Um, oh, hang on. What was that? Hang on, hang on. What? Was, was the glorious leader looking through the blinds at, <laughs> at the people in the ladies' changing room? <laughs> Is that what he was doing? Yes. <laughs> That's very funny. Okay, so he's perving on them. Glorious leader outlaws privacy. Okay, how do I do... Are these going to fall down? If I click that. Oh, they get lifted up. Oh, and they, and then they run out. Okay, so they run out into the thing. Ah, and then I can drop a box on their head. <laughs> yes. Okay, so now he doesn't know what to do now because the blinds are up. <laughs> this, is, this is this is ridiculous. Again, yeah, it is a little bit where's wally S with all the stuff going on. There's so much stuff happening in this level. Oh, that rocket's doing something. Can I click? Oh, look, it's open. The side of the rocket's come open. Is that something I need to be aware of? Okay, his statue. Let's get this woman sorted. It's got to be something to do with this. What's that? A light. An insignificant bucket full of paint. Let's knock a load of paint onto his statue. Is that going to irritate him? Oh, glorious leader, your statue has been vandalised. Okay, glorious leader. <coughs> whoever you might be. Uh, who vandalised my statue? Because that's how he sounds. Um, and glorious leader has finally left the room, but I can't open the door. Okay, is that a door? Okay, well, let's open the door. My dear, there's so much I want to tell you. Uh, and they are... Oh! The, the, the security guy. The security guy and the glorious leader's whatever. Wife, girlfriend, slave, I don't know, whatever. The lady in the in the fun time room is 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 having it away with the security guy from here. Hang on. So far... Oh, 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 angels. Angels, leave the angels alone. Leave them alone. Oh no, we'll be killed if Glorious Leader finds us. <gasps> Will you indeed? Well, that certainly is intriguing. Let me do this. Open that door. Wait for me, my dear. In he comes. <gasps> He's found the two of them. He's found the two of them. Kill them! I they're going to be shot to death, I would imagine. This is quite horrible. Yep, okay. Bang and bang. This is what happens to traitors. Okay, and there's the, our third target. Every rose has its thorn. Oh, I'm very sorry. You were probably really nice. Um, okay. Oh, oh, oh. I was going to say, that looks like an obvious thing you can drop on someone's head. This also looks like an obvious thing you can drop on someone's head. Can you drop a cupboard on someone? Oh, possibly. Ooh. Oh, no. Missed. Missed. I thought I could get it, but I missed. I wasn't quick enough. Okay, come back to this one. Come back to this one. Somebody go in this cupboard. Somebody look in this cupboard. You swines. There we go. 29 souls. So, I need 10 more. I've done a pretty good job of not looking at the hint so far. I've got 10 things left. So, there must be something which kills a great number of people. Right, that thing is going to kill him because he will fall down. Presumably, that is a big hole. However, I can't do it because the angels are floating about in the middle. I simply can't click it because I will get got by the angels. That's not ideal, is it? Ah, move out the way, angels! <laughs> Stop going to the middle. Go and look around the edges now. Go and look where I've just been. Go and look on those right here. Look here, here. Unless that one turns round, we've got this. Yes, he's gone down a great big manhole. Oh no! Does that mean more? Or are they just here for longer? Yeah. Okay. The angel police are here. Okay. Oh, there's just more of them. There's one, two, three, four, five. Ah, oh, good grief. Uh, okay. Okay, this has got to be something. This has got to be a thing. Uh, box just there on you. Okay, that can kill you. That's absolutely fine. Uh, okay, the furnace. Okay, turn the thing. A valve that controls the gas pipe. Okay, turn it. 
Nothing. And click that. It sure gets hot in here. No. Okay. Uh, that thing. Oh, that can kill those guys. So that's good. We're up to 32. Uh, okay, so the gas pipe didn't do anything. There's an angel nearby. I have to not do anything for a little while until you go away. What is that waiting to? The nozzle is slightly damaged. What could go wrong? Uh, okay, can we wait for you to walk in front of it? Okay. <laughs> that blew his head off, right? Okay. Sure gets hot in here. Sure gets hot in here. Okay, I can't interact with that right now. Why not? What do I need to do with that? Control the gas and then do the thing. Control the gas. Click on... Ah, control the... Hang on. Control the gas. Click that thing. And then the furnace. No. Okay, that's not working as obviously as I thought. What does that little diagram show? Don't throw stuff in while there's gas going. A valve that controls the gas pipe. Ah! <laughs> there we go. There we go. <laughs> so, yeah, there we go. Follow the instructions on the wall. It works. Okay, brilliant. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is a very silly game. Um, so we need four more people. Let's look at the hints. Uh, okay, there's a big container of some sort. A little a box. Uh, what's that? A window or a wall? A machine thing. That's in the middle. I don't know what that is. I'm unable to identify what that is by looking at it. This thing here, though. This thing here must do something. That's lit up. I, I don't know what it's doing. And I don't want to do anything while they're there. That, I bet we can roll something into that. Okay, that's made it go wrong. Ah, maintenance man. And now, if I click on that a couple of times, does that kill him? Yes, okay. That that picks him up, drops him into... Oh, no! <laughs> okay, he's been mangled by the uh, by the industrial machinery. Oh, there's his body. Look, still twitching. Lovely. Okay, 36. I need three more people. Who can I squash? You. Nope, these are that they're not collapsible things. Uh this this thing that was on it. That was on it. Oh goodness me. Um yeah, there's a lot of angels going around. <laughs> I need to do this without the yeah, look at glistening. So this is something to do with it. The darn fans stuck. Oh, there's so many angels around this bit. Go away, go away, you heavenly pests. Away with you it's you, you. I'll have you. Yeah, because look, he's on the fans. And I need to press this button, but they are all... Look, look how, look how much they're around. <laughs> okay, everybody. Will you start the fans, please? Yep, there we go. He's been put into the fans and has been minced. 37. I need two more people to kill. Right, okay. Do that. And there. That's another person dead. 38. 38 dead. One more. What are these guys in the middle doing? There's two guys in the middle. Clicking on those. Do they do anything? Oh. I don't know what that did, but that looked cool. Oh, they it blows stuff out of them. Okay. Oh, 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 careful. No, didn't quite reach. Didn't quite reach them. Okay, no, I can't get those. Oh, no, I've done it. 39, because I got a treble or a double kill or something. So what's still remaining? What is still remaining? A little gas... A, a, a gas pipe... Ooh, a handle thing. A window of some sort. And whatever that thing is. I don't know what that thing is. Um, is it that poster that needs to come down? Is it the poster? Does something happen with this poster here? Go on, angels. Shifty, shifty thy angelic bottoms out of the way. I want to see if that's anything. Yes. Okay, an immaculate poster. What happens if it comes down? Nothing. Nothing happens with that. Okay. This... Nothing there either. Now, well, I assume we can't kill him, which is a bit annoying. Our glorious leader sure loves that statue of his. A bit too much. Okay, I'm with you. I get what you're saying. Can we do that? Yes, okay. That kills that person. Okay, so we're done. What is that? What's that then? And where's that extra little valve? What on earth is this thing? A thing with... It's hard to work it out, Silhouette. It looks like it has wheels. But I can't work out what that is. I thought I clicked on most things. Is it this? That? No. This? No. That? No. That? No. 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 <laughs> what is that? 
Uh, that's got wheels. That's it's not that though. That thing. It's got bits coming up over the top of it. And then yeah, that looks like wheels to me. That looks like they should have two little wheels sticking on the outside. Oh, is it this? Is it his truck of things? Uh, okay. Can I click on his truck? Maybe it needs to be loaded with some stuff. Maybe the, the stuff needs to be on his truck and it blows up or something. It looks like oil canisters. So this is probably a good bet. Okay, right. There's a million angels around. This is probably not going to work, is it? Because they're going to be able to see me. That's unfortunate. Right, do it now. No. No, maybe it's not him then. Maybe it's not that. Okay, uh, do you know what? Fine. We got to 40. We got past the uh, 39 thing. I think that's absolutely fine right now. Yes, Death, we are done here. We have done quite a good job. I don't know what that thing is. And I don't know where this little turny valve thing is. But other than that, we have done a Actually. sterling job. Next stage, please. Okay, three more wishy little soul things went into this bit, so I assume now the other people are waiting. Yep, so those two people and him are waiting here in limbo with the three we got from earlier. And our next level appears to be a pyramid. So Egypt, presumably, that's got pyramids. Or Las Vegas, maybe. Smile, your fate is sealed. Okay, here we go. Let's see what this brings. Oh, it's a museum. This is my favourite piece in the entire collection. And there are some security guards. Sir, what do you need? Oh, look at him. He's got a dapper moustache. The museum opens tomorrow. My collection must be something or other. Just be careful. Yes, sir, everything something. Goodness me, you talk quickly, you people. Okay, once you have it, hide it and get out as soon as possible. What's this? I'll just take it anyway. Okay, I don't know what that was. He picked up a key. Was it a key? Might have been a key. Looking forward to the museum tour. Lots of incredible things can happen here. Okay, good. Right. Incredible things being what? And there's a, an obvious thief. Remember to keep an eye on strange people. <laughs> I'm deaf. I'm deaf. I am a strange person. I'm able to kill people using magical powers. It uh, might make your mission easier. Now let's get reaping. Okay, there's an obvious computer that's going all funny there. Can we electrocute that person? Oh, apart from they didn't use the computer. So they're not going to be electrocuted. I thought that would have electrocuted that person using that computer. Move out of the way. Go on. Zap. Um, oh, I can't use the computer. Ah, I knocked the water onto it. There we go. Right, okay. Right, here we go. Go on, sit down. You two, you two, stop doing that. And first blood. Splosh. And yes, dead. First blood. Finally, my chance. Okay. Oh, you've ran in and stolen a thing. Okay, they've ran in and stolen a thing. Okay, what I might do is, with a game like this... Oh, look, it looks lovely. From the from when you zoom out, it looks really nice. A nice detail. Like, yeah, you zoom in, it obviously goes to pixel art, which is brilliant as well. I like him with his uh, quiffed hair and his sort of dapper moustache. He's very cool. But yeah, I like when you zoom out. It looks really lovely. Oh. Oh no, nothing up there. I thought there might be something up there. There's a oh, there's a giant trebuchet catapult thing in my bob up there. Yes. Okay. Oh, bees. Security guard. Get the bees. Oh, oh, it didn't get the security guard. It got a couple just there. Okay. Is the security guard going to go and investigate? Uh, no, he just got got by the bees. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, what I'm going to do is with this level, I'm going to play it through, and if I find interesting stuff, I will. I will obviously come back to it but with a game like this i think part of the fun is figuring it out and if you are interested in playing this game i don't want to then go through and go haha look this is how you do all of the answers what on earth is that thing what is that a rare tentacle mushroom so uh oh oh can that squash somebody can somebody come by and get squashed please look it's very obviously here for someone to stand underneath it and get squished come on squish Oh, they have to be standing literally right here. Okay, fine. You, you, yeah. Ah, too slow, too slow. You. Yes, there we go. What the flip they just said there. Uh, yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'll go through, I'll I'll find, if anything interesting, I imagine there's going to be lots of bizarre bits in this, but I'm not going to show every single death like I have done the previous two. I shall just try my best. And if there's interesting ones, we'll obviously, yeah, have a look at it. But yeah, just drop it. I mean, I imagine I can drop these signs on people. I imagine that's going to be a thing. 
So, uh, yeah, all that kind of stuff I will leave. But, yeah, interesting stuff to do with the lamp or this pyramid or these weird tentacle things. Oh, look, it's um, uh, Thingy. What's his name from Little Shop of Horrors? What's he called? Feed me. Seymour. Seymour. It's Seymour from Little Shop of Horrors. Okay. Who are the people I've got to kill, by the way? You. In fact, let's target these first. Let's get these done, and then I shall go through and do the rest of it. So you... Uh, you, you're just sat on a bench, and some girl just there. Oh, 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 oh! I can drop a coconut on that man. Right, the girl has panicked, but that's fine. Because now, what's that? I don't know what that is. What's what's that? A bomb. Oh, a bomb. Uh, okay. I wasn't expecting a bomb. Oh, there's two of the same girl. Which one is our girl? Right, that one. This one here. Okay, she's walking over to the trash bin. That's very good. That's very responsible of you. I don't I feel like I shouldn't actually blow you up with this bomb that I'm going to blow you up with. <laughs> Bang! Okay, right. I've blown up one of our targets. But I never got to the gift shop. Oh, yeah, you were only in the coffee shop, I think, weren't you? This looks like the coffee shop. Uh, yeah, look, that looks like a coffee menu. <laughs> oh, no. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, okay, that. Oh, oh, botherations. Yeah, missed. I was being too eager. Uh, okay, you. Where were you? You're a scientist. Uh, okay, this looks like an obvious thing. A feeding platform. How do you go... Uh, do we click on that? Do we click on this? Do not worship with blood sacrifice. Ah, ha, ha. Okay, we need to get some people in in there, do we? Is that what we need to do? Is the botanical garden not open yet? Is this the botanical garden? Okay, am I supposed to open the botanical garden somehow? Him. He's got a key... Is that going to kill him? Is he stood in front of that enough? I don't think that's going to kill That's going to kill him. Boom. Yes. Squashed. <gasps> the key. Okay. Right. The botanical garden is open. Ah. And he has unlocked both doors to those bits. Okay. Right. That helps. In comes live stream person. Uh, okay. What's that do? Under protection of the security guard, it's suspiciously red. Death traps with green auras require a bit more coaxing. See if you can figure it out. Okay, there's normally a thing to lure the security guards away, like a speakery thing. Okay, broadcast. Right. And then does this eat him as it goes by? Yes. Yes, okay, I've eaten him. Now do that thing. With that. I, mean, I don't know what that... Oh my god! <laughs> it just pushed loads of people it just puts loads of people into the big uh, their acid pit, whatever it is. Okay, yes. Divine intervention has occurred because I've just killed a load of people. <laughs> ah, and look. Him. Target is climbing up here. Let's switch the platform off. And he falls in. And he is dealt with. Okay. I hope I get superpowers. Yeah, like yeah, immortality. Bit late for that now, eh? Right, the last one then is, is the guy outside on a bench was he outside yes okay hang on can we kill some more people this thing times down and there's still people stood in front of it oh there's an angel there's an angel okay you how can we kill him what do we do with him exactly what can we do with him what's that do oh okay not that not that uh okay right well let me see if i can figure out how to kill kind of <laughs> godfather type man sitting on a bench so I'm not entirely sure how we go about that right now. Oh, hang on. This thing might help. Let's fire a rock at him and see if that kills him. Oh, no. Just crashed into that. Uh, okay. Finally my chance. The thief. Ah, the thief is nicking this thing because the director guy has gone out to look at look at what's going on. Okay, right. This makes sense. He's looking at that going, goodness me. I'm quite cross. That's annoying. He's going to come in here. Check the tapes. We need to find out who did this. It was me. Hello. Okay, you want me to do that? It's taking way too long. We really need some new equipment. Yeah, that's a beach. That's not where you are. Next. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I really hope no one saw that video. Okay, and then the next one is a... Okay, that was unexpected. He's turned into a werewolf. Right, he... and he's eaten a lady. Right. He's going to eat the guy. <laughs> it's another one of the targets. Yeah, yeah, he's been eaten by a werewolf. Which was triggered... Buy a video. Oh my goodness. But I still haven't finished my sandwich. That is actually a tragedy. It depends what the sandwich is. But that is bad news. Oh no. You didn't finish your sandwich. I actually feel sorry for you. Okay. The werewolf is just going around butchering everybody that's outside. 
<laughs> my god. Uh, okay, this looks really obvious. What's this? Legend has that these pillars keep the count down. The count down. Very good. Okay. Oh, I see where this is going. Hang on. Let's close the blind. Let's do this. Does a vampire come out? Yes, it does. <laughs> okay. Right. Now we have a vampire going around killing people. Right. You're feeling drained. You're dead. <laughs> A vampire! There's a massive vampire going around killing everybody. Okay, right then. I think we're well on our way to 68 uh, people dead. If we've got vampires and things being able to help us, that's quite useful. Um, okay, right. Now let's do what I actually said. Now we've got the three targets down. Let me just go through, work my way through everybody else. Oh, time to rest again. Okay, he's going back. He helps me though a little bit. That was splendid. Jolly good. Well done. Uh, yeah, so let's go through. Let's figure out a few more bits and bobs, and uh, then we'll come back and yeah, because I don't want to, I don't want to show you how to do it all. If you do choose to play this game, some of it will be uh, the fun will be in finding out yourself. Oh, hang on, do the thing, push them in. That's another two people done, sorted. Uh, before we go, this looks suitably obvious. Shoot that at that. There's an electrical cable. Let's electrocute. Oh, I only electrocuted one person. That's a bit unfortunate. Uh, oh, a wibbly pillar. Oh, another wibbly pillar. Can we have a wibbly pillar? All these people are very quick. Oh, I killed the wrong person. I didn't want to kill you. You. You've got a bomb. You've got a bomb. Okay, right. We'll blow this bomb up in the middle just there. Oh, no. There's not enough people there now. Do the bomb. There we go. More angels. Okay, with more angels in, it's going to take a little while for me to do this. So, I shall get on with it. And if interesting things happen, we shall come back and see what went on. Okay, so I've reassembled some amber down here in the right order, and a giant dinosaur has appeared and is breathing fire. <laughs> I mean, oh, it, it was very ineffective, but I mean, it looked quite cool. Um, so, yes, I, I, I electrocuted some people here. I've killed some people in this thing. Uh, this, oh, hang on, this was completely surrounded before, but now I might be able to get to the lamp. I need to do something with that. With that, do I? Okay, that goes onto the lamp. What's the lamp going to do? Rub it lightly to make people vanish. Okay. I just killed some people. Okay. I, didn't, I don't know what happened there. I killed some randomers. Okay, that's fine. That thing could fall on him. Right, he has a bomb as well. So let's try and use the bomb really quick. quick, 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 quick. Boom. Okay, lots of people got exploded just then. I think. I thought they did. I thought lots of people got killed just then. But maybe they escaped somehow. Uh, okay, that thing could be fun. Oh, it missed. <laughs> it missed. No, oh, I thought it was going to get somebody. Uh, okay, and other than that, yeah, I've not really done anything greatly exciting. I've just been dropping things on people's heads and stuff. And, uh, yeah, pushing people off with this thing occasionally. Oh, oh, that looks really obvious. Okay, yeah, that was pretty flipping obvious, wasn't it? Uh, does that do anything else? Oh, yeah, it does. It kills these people down here. Okay, we're on 53. There we go. We can get some more of these people dead, I'm fairly certain. Ah, okay. I just squashed the thief that stole the thing from the, the the boss's office, the weird sort of shape thing, and it's floated up here to the top of the pyramid. So I'm assuming that goes into that gap. And then what? A new achievement. Oh my goodness, I have unleashed some sort of ancient Egyptian monster. Oh no, it can't get back to the door. It's too big. Okay. <laughs> that was unexpected. Um, the top of the pyramid does turn round. I might give that a go. Oh, in a second. Once the angels have gone by, I might give that a go. Oh, I see. As soon as I want to do this, is it? All the angels converge on the thing, on the shiny new toy. Okay, so let's turn it round. And again. Uh, okay, no, maybe that doesn't do anything then. Okay, these head things fall off as well. So I'm going to try and crush a few people with this. Oh, no one, go, no one walks on those squares. I've tried to get people to walk to just there, look. No one walks just there. I need three more people. Come on. Come on. There must be... Oh, no. The chance I get to do that. Hang on. Bosh. That's killed at least one person. Everyone else panicking. Everyone else running around. Okay. Two more people. I think we might have to wait for the tour to come through here and then just push them off on this thing because I can't see any other ways that I've got of killing people. On the hints, there's loads of stuff. Coconuts. Don't know what that is. There's a tube thing. There's a couple of bits in the vampire room which I know I can use, but then no one goes to them. Like, no one goes to this little torture cupboard thing. No one goes to that. 
Everyone just goes over to this bit here, look. So I can't do this bit. I can't do anything with it. Uh, oh, that might be quite a good fun thing to do, actually. Well, let's do that, shall we? Yep, there's another one down. There's another one down. Person 67 was that. That's person 67. Splendid. We need one more. One more. Come on. Come on. Uh, okay, can we do that thing? Can we do that? Yep, yeah, bats come out. And no, there's no one around. There's no one around. There's no one around. Bats, go and find someone to eat. You, you, you're, you'll do. You're a victim. You'll do. Yep, feeling drained. And... Boom, 68. Okay, we've achieved the minimum requirement. I don't think I did that as efficiently as I could have done. I think there are still things that I've done. Oh, yes, we knocked the skeleton down on people. That was fairly obvious. Don't know what that is. Can't figure out what that thing is. Uh, I, yeah, I don't know what that is. I can't work that out. And um, that's the squishy thing just there. Palm tree. Yeah, this thing here. I don't know what that is either. There's a couple of posters at all. Bits of wall that fall down. I don't know what that is. Like a, as a cylinder thing somewhere. But I really don't know where that is. I really can't find where it is. It's nowhere. Oh, this thing. Ah, maybe it's this. Ah, maybe it's this. Hang on. Let's just see if it explodes. Yeah. Oh, it falls down. It squishes people. Oh, come on. Come and have a look at the specimens. Come on. Come and look at the lovely things. Uh, yeah, let's squish you. Yay. An extra one for good luck. 69 people. All squished. Uh, oh, I was going to say, if he walks past that plant, we can get that to kill him. We can get that to eat him. Yep, yeah, no, yep, yeah, no, no. Oh, and there's an angel there now anyway. Okay, no, we're done. I think that's fine. Death, death, we're done. Hello, death. Where? Hello, there you are. Right, yes, next stage, please. We've done, we've done okay. We've got the three main people anyway, and we have done absolutely fine. Next stage, please. Yep, yeah, so all the people are in there now, look. All the people from the uh, three stages we've done, the three people from each are in this kind of weird, grayed out limbo land. And we have... A scythe sticking out of the ground with a thing at the bottom. Let's click on the scythe. What's this? Bonus Judgment Day. Okay, we're going to face Terminators or something. What's going on? Uh, is that me? Oh, I look quite cute. Uh, it's time for revenge. How many angels can you wipe out? I get to kill the angels. Annihilating green angels will give you more time, while annihilating red angels will enhance your weapon. Don't let more than 100 angels escape. Okay, so that looks like time. What have I got to do? I'm up there, floating about. Uh, do I click on it? Oh, I lob a thing! I don't know what the thing is, but I lob something at it nonetheless. Okay, oh, let's kill you. You've got time, apparently, which might be quite nice. Oh, this is glorious. Look at it. Do, 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 do. Oh, I, th <laughs> I throw massive vending machines. <laughs> okay, yep, have that. Have a vending machine, you... Oh, God, that was a good shot. Okay, yeah, we let one go. That's fine. Yep, get you. That'll upgrade our weapon. That gives us some time. Uh, okay, what's that? A kind of scythe boomerang. Okay, I like that. That's cool. Yeah, scythe boomerangs. More scythe boomerangs. More thick, more throwing vending machines at people. Yep, this is cool. Right, more vending machines. Oh, now I've got, now I've got high explosives. <laughs> I've got explosives. Okay, boom. You... Boom, another weapon upgrade. Oh, here we go. Just pepper out some stuff. Time is running out. 28, 27. Yeah, just keep just keep firing. It's fine. There's only 90. Oh, they've got loads of time. Oh, loads of angels left. It'll be time that'll run out, I imagine. Right, okay. Explosives again. Oh, the explosives are brilliant. Just wait for them all to come by and just destroy them all. <laughs> bang. Uh, and bang. And this is all normal again. Okay, yeah. They got through. Never mind. Right, again, yeah. Magic, magic boom, boomer scythe. That'll do. And explosives again. Splendid. Yeah, I'm going to run out of time, aren't I? I think more than anything else. This is quite good fun, though. Yeah, I've not let many of the angels through. I oh, know, I've got a bit more time. I've got a bit more time. I've got some more boomer scythes. That'll do. Kill you. You give me some time. Kill more boomer scythes. More weapons. Yes, I could do with the uh, vending machine things again. The vending machines are quite useful. Going in a straight line. Uh, yeah, okay, right. I think we're doing okay. We'll just keep going. I don't know. We've got to get... We've got 49 more in. 46 more in. And then that's game over. Or the time's got to run out. But we keep acquiring plenty of time as we go. Oh, oh, did I go back to normal weapons there? Again, more time. And it gets down to 11. And then it keeps topping up again. Okay, another weapon. I think it's the same. I think it's Boomer Scythes. Yep, yeah, let's just keep going. Get you, get you. 15 seconds. 
Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. What a high score. Yes, lots of exploding things happening. We like explosions in the gate cupboard. Right, and boom, and boom. And I think it might be the angels are going to get through. That's probably what's going to finish the game more than the time. Yeah, okay, that's fine. There we go. 60, 611,600. Yes, I'll take that. Okay, thank you very much. And the next level has been revealed, and it is some sort of snowy level with a Christmas tree on it. I'm not going to do that because it's going to ask me to kill Santa. And I think we are going to leave it there. You get the idea with this. It's a nice puzzly game. There's different bits. Cause and effect. You know, you click one thing and turn a dial and press a button, and then someone comes to look at something. You can drop a box on their head, and that then frees up the post where they once were to then go and do something else with. And yeah, there's lots of inventive ways to go and dispatch people and do stuff. And some of it's timing. You have to make sure that people are under certain bits if you're dropping them on their heads but yeah it's a good fun game i actually really enjoy this i think it looks lovely it plays well it's got like nice comedy bits in like you know kim jong un up here i wasn't expecting to see him in a game <laughs> um, particularly his whatever it was his, his mistress who's having a little bit of a fling with the uh with the security guard who's looking after her so um yeah, I do quite like this. But yeah, I want to leave it there. I don't want to sort of solve all the puzzles and everything for everybody. I'd rather, if you do like this game, then if you do like it, then if you go and buy it, you can then figure it out yourself and it should be lovely and rewarding. And if you don't particularly like it, then either you're not watching this right now because you don't like the game or you're not going to buy it. So there's no point in me going on anyway. So there we go. So Death Coming is fun. It's on Steam. I don't think it was very much. I think it was on offer on Steam when I picked it up anyway. So it should be fairly cheap. I don't think it was that expensive if you want to go and pick it up on Steam. But there we go. So that's that finished. I think I might play a little bit more of this. I quite enjoy it. Again, though, I don't want to do this level if it requires me to kill Santa. Because that will make me one of the worst. No, not one of. It will make me the worst person that ever lived. Because killing Santa is just a, a no-go. You don't do that. That's not a thing you do. Who would bring the presents? There we go. All done. So there's nothing else left for me to say except Happy New Year. Thank you for joining me throughout the Geek Cupboard in 2017. If you're an old subscriber, if you're a new subscriber, thank you for watching. I said this all before in the little video, the retrospective video that we had to before this one came out. But it's, you know, it, it deserves saying again, thank you very much for watching and contributing and joining in. And I hope to see you in 2018. For now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard. And I will see you next time. Everyone loves barbecued rat. My compliments to the chef. I don't think he did much. He literally stuck a stick up the rat's bottom and put it on a fire. Shrieking weird ladies in the water. Probably not a good thing. The heroes offer a decisive solution to all the woman's riddles. <laughs> By shoving her off the bridge. Yay. Yay for the chiseled stick. <laughs>